The workers of VS Hydro Limited who came to construct Nyamuga Sani 1 and 2 hydropower in Cherumba Sub County and Cherumba Town Council impregnated 31 girls and abandoned them without any help. The contract was awarded to VS Hydro Limited and signed on 31st March 2017. The official work commenced on 26th June 2017 under the limited notice to proceed agreement. According to the chairperson LC3, Charumba Sub County, Buambale Ivan, 31 teenagers in the sub county and Charumba Town Council were impregnated. Uh, these people are actually 31, according to the record that I have, and I generated this record using a social worker after having had information that there are many children, there are many women, many young mothers, many girls in the community who have a challenge that has come as a result of the mixing that they had with the staff of the, of the hydropower project. And of course, as a leader, I was concerned. I started to interrogate and this interest led me to profiling each and every young person. He added that out of the 31 teenage mothers that gave birth, 14 of them were underage, ranging from 15 to 17 years, and three of the 14 were infected with HIV and AIDS. Out of the 31 people, the victims that gave birth to children, fathered by the staff of the project, 14 of them were under age, ranging from 15 to 17 years. And when I engaged with them more, three of them declared to me that they have, they ended up, they realized themselves with, with having, having been HIV positive. And this is too sad, but we have given them psychosocial support and made sure that they can continue living even with this kind of situation. South African Family TV spoke to some of the victims who said that the workers of VS Hydro Limited who came to construct Nyamuga Sani 1 and 2 hydropower promised to marry them but unfortunately after impregnating them they decided to abandon them. They say locating them seems hard since their phone numbers cannot go through. We were, uh, we were deceived by some men who came in this charumba to make their business. Some pregranted us, and nowadays we, we have no help. Some, when we, when we try to, to look for them, they are phone, they are phone, they are off, and we have no help. We have children, some that are still young, others that are, they are, now, they are now growing up. Some, we have nothing to give them. We have no work, we have no job, we're just at home. Our parents also they have their problems at home. They don't have anything how they can care for us. Since we, we are young mothers, have no help. I get an unwanted pregnancy while I'm missing here too. Uh -huh. Now the, the, my parents help me while I'm pregnant. Now, they are looking after for my child. Then they told me that I should go to school and learn. This call upon government to offer them hand skills so that they can work for their children. The State Minister for ICT and National Guidance, Honorable Kabianga Godfrey Baluku, confirmed the incident, but he appealed to young girls to be careful for their lives whenever they see such projects in their communities. Those those young girls who were pregnant, it's very unfortunate. They will be among uh, the costs we got during construction of that power, power plant. But I would like to appeal to young girls, please take care of your life. Leave alone being pregnant. But those guys might have even left them diseased.
you may meet some of them have HIV. He advised the leadership of Charumba sub-county to continue with the matter and work closely with Nyambugansani Hydropower Management and trust the fathers of these children. I think the community development office of Charumba should take, take up the issue. There are some way Ugandans who can be, who can be traced and uh, they take their children. Even the Sirangans can be traced. And if they can uh, do a DNA and they find you are really they are really the fathers of those children. It is uh, 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 there are courts of law. The probation officers are there. There are laws governing. Uh, uh, there are so many children laws. Uh, so when you produce a child, you are uh, under obligation to look after that child. Efforts to reach Namugansani Hydropower Plant Management were futile since the contract ended. No one was there to speak to us.